check in with Storm Team 2's Ariel Hooli to see how the rest of your weekend's going to shape up. Plenty of rain in the forecast, but not so bad when it wasn't raining. But when it comes down, Ariel, it's coming down. Yeah, Laura. And the problem with today was yeah. we had enough spin in the atmosphere that we actually got a couple of reports of funnel clouds wow. and even some water spouts. So the atmosphere was just yeah. primed for that. Not looking as likely tomorrow. And we're going to be able to bring those rain chances down a little bit. We just can't eliminate them. Guys, it's summer here in the low country. We can't eliminate those thunderstorm chances for quite a while. So be prepared. Just keep an eye to the sky tomorrow. Tonight, we've calmed down quite a bit out there. I am still tracking this one shower just offshore, although within the last half hour, it's really fallen apart. The question is whether it stays together to come on shore. It's looking more and more unlikely, but it's something I'll keep an eye on for you guys. That rain took quite a hit on our temperatures. Most of us into the 70s with dew points into the 70s as well. So it is feeling pretty tropical out there. Dew points are a pretty good indicator of where your temperatures are going to fall. So we're going to stay in the 70s for the remainder of your evening. Those rain chances to, will continue to diminish, but they won't completely go away. So as you wake up tomorrow morning, we're talking temperatures into the 60s inland, mid to upper 70s along the coastline. A very sticky start to your Sunday. But again, Laura, I'm tracking the slight chance for that shower chance tomorrow. All the details on when and where the showers are most likely coming up.